It's been two weeks now since Olathe East senior James McGinnis suffered a major head injury and collapsed during a Friday night football game. For the first time, his parents are sharing an update on their son's recovery. Sayed Shabir spoke with the family. Joins us live now from Overland Park Regional Medical Center. Sayed. Jal, James is still in the ICU right now. He can open his eyes and only use hand signals to communicate, but his parents are feeling comforting and optimistic. Take a look at uh, the hospital room inside Oakland Park Regional Medical Center. Uh, it's been flooded with posters, pictures, and banners. Friends and classmates, even kids from rival schools have stopped by to show their support. His parents say there are kids visiting all the time. In fact, each night there's at least 20 kids offering their prayers and support. I spoke to his dad, Patrick, who said there was a breakthrough moment earlier this week. It was James and I have always had a signal that since second grade when we were out in public we would shoot the I love you sign so that we wouldn't embarrass him in front of his friends and, and we did that even when he was in high school getting on the team bus we'd shoot it and he'd shoot it back through the window and so last Wednesday he shot that sign back to us and uh, and so uh, you know that was a, that was probably one of the best moments in, in 18 years to see him shoot that sign back to me. And Patrick said he is sending that I love you signal to the rest of his friends and family who have been sending their support to him. But there's still a long way uh, ahead of him as far as getting back on his feet. But doctors say that he's doing everything that he is expected to do at this point in the recovery. He will be going to a rehab facility in Nebraska early next week. Reporting live in Overland Park, Sayed Shabir, 41 Action News.